we are facing challenges coming from the market due to the fact that our customers need different kinds of packaging, different kinds of stacking, different kinds of contains of their, their products. So we have to react quite quick and have to have uh, solutions on the line that uh, give us the possibility to have changeovers in the short term. We started to work with Integena uh, approximately uh, 25 years ago. We have a good relationship. Um, they basically bought machines from the very beginning with our group. Um, so we saw all, all the developments throughout the years. The issue was at about a speed of 650 to 700 ppm, meaning vipers per minute. Uh, the, the old technology was on the end. So for the last seven, eight years, there was no technology available to achieve higher speeds. Then came the new Rockwell um, component that helped us to achieve higher speeds. So we were testing this unit in Schwäbisch Hall in our uh, headquarter for five years, developing a new system that now is capable of using the same process as in the old days with the new technology going up to speeds to 1200. So for us that was a huge step and that helped us with this customer who is very limited in space and needs a high flexibility. iTrack is an innovative motion system which is based on independently controlled movers running along a closed path which can be of any shape the customer wants. The independence of those movers and the technology underlying, which is the linear motor technology, are giving our customers incredible flexibility and improved performances compared to existing technology. The advantages for Integena with this new system is, and I think the, the main and, and most important is that they can, can run 1200 ppm, up to 1200 ppm with this system nowadays. In the old days they were buying up to 700 ppm. Uh, the next thing is the flexibility. Uh, they can very, in, within 30 minutes, can change a count, which in the past was a mechanical to do things. Somebody had to crap and, and, and do something with the hand. And of course, um, the uh, reliability is still the same process as they had in the past, just with a modern design. And of course, we also hope that in the end, uh, there will be less spare parts because in the old chain-driven system, need, we, we're very likely is a uh, higher consumption of uh, spare parts than the new system will be. I think that's the main thing. So in the end, faster speed, cheaper production for them, and, uh, and still the old reliable process that should be the perfect match for them. Advanced motion control is important in this application because we need a high acceleration of in, within the process. Uh, if a baby diaper comes on a constant flow of 1200 diapers per minute flying at our machine, we have to catch it somehow. And when you create a stack and you want to create the next stack, you have in between a border. And that means we have a very fast movement to make. And it's within, uh, there's 20 uh, baby diapers in a second that needs to be done. So within one of these steps you have to move and this very fast movement was impossible to do before there was an iTrack system. I think that is the main reason why we have it. Managers and operators like the solution from the beginning. First of all, the, um, the managing director here uh, is a, a technology freak. He likes the new technology and he, he liked the idea that he can keep the same process. And so from the beginning he said, let's do that together. Let's find a solution that is uh, with the new iTrack system that will work for us. So that was very good. The operators themselves also like it a lot because it's simple for them to operate. It's the same process um, and they also got other new designs in the machines uh, that they were not expecting. So overall they like the machine very much. So it was from the beginning a success story in that case. With the demand of higher production speed of the uh, production lines itself, we were asked to put those products into the bags and with a new solution we are now capable to create clear regular stacks that enter to the um, bags and are no longer limited due to mechanical uh, restrictions. We are running those lines now since 
almost one year and the results are very promising. We achieved the uh, demands on an, uh, within a short term and uh, we see that there are still possibilities to exceed speeds and to uh, run those lines at higher volumes also.